I had the southern fried catfish. It's topped with a green goddess with avocado and a little bit of heat. Down at the end there, I did the hoe cakes, a Maker's Mark bacon bourbon gastrique. Uh, next, I did a take on rabbit and dumplings. Instead of rabbit, I did a roasted garlic confit chicken wings, spring veg, and dumplings made from a biscuit dough. So I made a, my own version of the burgoo, which is a, it's an Argentinian preparation. The name is locro. It has some braised ham hocks, braised short rib, seared sausage, and chorizo colorado. So I made a uh, grilled lamb loin. It's been cured with bourbon and smoked, a sweet potato puree, and then a Kentucky black barbecue sauce. So what we have today is a play on a traditional Gabonese dish from Africa, baked bananas gabon. But what we did is uh, brulee them today. Uh, we have a uh, Meyer lemon and blood orange marmalade. Final dish. <laughs> There's a lemon pie, little Meyer lemon curd, some mascarpone, and a little bourbon and sorghum glaze in there. Thank awesome. you. Thank you. Thank you, Chef. Thank you all. Appreciate it. Oh, there we go. Tastes good. Yes, Catfish. Sir. Yes, thank you. That lamb is cooked well. It's delicious. It's actually. cooked really, really well, yeah. All right, let's talk about Eddie's bourbon cured lamb. I love the flavor and the contrast from the lamb itself and the blackberry walnut sauce. Mm -hmm. I think Eddie did a nice job on the lamb. It's well seasoned, it's well cooked. It's about, but frankly, the only thing on this table that is actually seasoned. I think Pablo's stew is well seasoned. Oh, I don't at all. In Pablo's stew, I got a lot of grease. Mm -hmm. Oversaturation of meat. Kelsey's catfish look really appealing to me. I like the playful pickles in, in the jars. That said, to me, it was dry. And the pickles felt just like soggy vegetables. What do you think of Brandon's chicken wings and dumplings? The dumplings are a little undercooked. They're a little dry in the center. I think Tom is being really generous. I think it's an atrocity. Yeah. And I'm not even from here. I want to talk about Justin's hoe cakes. Well, I really love the bacon and bourbon. Mm -hmm. You know, I really like the flavor. He took his version and made it as good as it could be. So what do we think of the Gabonese bananas that Eric gave us? Oh, it was good. All the sweetness. I love the crunch behind it. Eric's dish kind of blows my mind. Tom, I know you are a fan of lemon curds. I love lemon curd. I love lemon meringue pie. Natalie's is just lacking that acid, that bite that you want out of a good curd. The crust wasn't crispy enough. It was very doughy. I question whether or not this dough is even cooked all the way. And this is like the other dishes we had today. A bit more seasoning, a bit more salt, sugar, acid would have brought it up.